Tango, now that you're familiar with how to find the volume of a solid, let's see if you can work out this exercise. Actually, it's one of your favorite exercises. Can you make a guess? Oh, I know. Statement problem. Haha, <laughs> you're right. Statement problems. A cubic container has an edge of 30 centimeters and is filled with water to a height of 5 centimeters. When a stone was placed in it, the water level rose to 10 centimeters. What is the volume of the stone? Edge of the cubic container equals 30 centimeters. Initial height of the water level equals 5 centimeters. We need to find the volume of the stone. Initial volume equals length times width times initial height of water level. 30 centimeters times 30 centimeters times 5 centimeters equals 4,500 cubic centimeters. Final height of water level equals 10 centimeters. Final volume equals length times width times final height of water level. 30 centimeters times 30 centimeters times 10 centimeters equals 9,000 cubic centimeters. Volume of the stone equals final volume minus initial volume. 9000 minus 4500 equals 4500 cubic centimeters. So the volume of the stone is 4500 cubic centimeters. Fine! An aquarium of length 30 cm and width 10 cm is filled with water to a height of 10 cm. When a stone was placed in it, the water level rose to 12 cm. What is the volume of the stone? Thank you for watching. Enroll now. To access all 107 videos totaling 10 hours and 41 minutes, featuring introductions, examples, and exercises for grade 5 math.